Hello, welcome there. Let's start today's class for this part two of Emacs. So make sure you read the question, read your question, and uh, follow the answer here. So number one, zero, uh, number zero question says, you can only have one buffer open in Emacs at a time. It's not true, it's false. Number two, number one question says, in Emacs, a buffer is an object that a file text is held in. That is true. In Emacs documentations, in Emacs documentation, what does M in the shortcut command stand for? It stands for Alt, which is alternate key on your keyboard, and uh, Meta. So Meta and Alt is the same thing. So then for the third question, he said, in Emacs, documentation what does c stand for in the short code is the answer is control then that's that let's close the quiz you can see that we have answered that quiz let's hide it so that we can face this one so oh i've got this i'm done they didn't mark my my class so let's quickly check this one i think for some reason i didn't i didn't submit this so i want to quickly do it now so everybody can benefit from it so let's quickly go to the terminal and uh, the city number navigate to the root directory and create uh, this folder so this is how you do it you just press cd enter okay you're already in the root directory how do we know w yeah we, you can see that we are in the directory then you can list all the files that are there you can see these are the folders that are there so how do we cd into our or how do we create a new folder if we don't have it there to create a new folder you say make directory then you press space then the, the, the folder name is x 0 x 0 2 2 underscore emacs right emacs sorry my e -max. I already have it then you press enter I already have it so once you put this syntax here this code here you press enter it will go to take you to the next to take you to this folder here so that's that once you create a folder once you create a folder it's, 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 if you can see now it said it's already that that, that that cannot be created that file already exists so what do you do now let's cd into that folder Yes, let's see the tweet. Let's see, this is so we see the into the folder now. We are inside the folder now. Then the next thing you do is to is to the next question says. So we have already once we create we have created this folder. The next question now it says that we should. Okay, what is the command for opening a file within Emacs? So. The answer should be in this format. So the answer should be in the root, in the full directory, and the file name. This should be the file name opening. So how do we get that done? So let's quickly go there. You type echo, double quotes. Your answer should be in capital C dash X space capital C dash F. Then you put it into you. You save it inside the folder. So that, if that folder does not exist, it will create it. Opening. Right? And you click enter. So how do we check if it's there? You can do more. Opening. See, you can see the file is there. Or you say cut. Opening. To check if the answer is there. So fine, it's there. So now let's go and check our answer. Let's check our answer if it's there or is there. So it's there. You can see the answer is correct. So let's close it. Then let's give the correct answer. These are 50 for late submission will come. So let's move to the next question. Why that one is still loaded? So the next question says, what is the command to save a file? Okay. The command to save a file. 
let's go there let's do it okay command to save a file you say echo do with me echo see Yes, sorry my kids and be fast so that the video will not be too long so saving I think it's what they saving let me show saving okay Let's cut it to see. Save you. Okay. okay. Let's check for our answer. Okay. You can see the answer is correct. Then let's close it. Let's request for our answer. Let's move to the next question. Next question we said. What is the command to cut an entire line? Okay, let's go now. The command to cut an entire line is say echo. Okay, this. Okay. Yeah, you can see the answer is correct. Then let's press the law is paste pasting. Okay, let's move it first. Then you see echo echo C dash Y. So save it into paste. Okay, you can see it's correct. Let's close it. So, searching forward searching. Okay, that's the next question. So, how do we forward searching? We say echo. We can bring echo. Okay, you can see it's correct. So let's replace our correction. So this one is undoing. So let's go for the question. Undoing, we have like three. So let's put the three answer there. How to undo? So we say echo. Echo. So you can use C slash to undo. You can use C slash underscore to undo. You can also use C dash X U to, to undo. So let's put our answer under undo. Mm. Okay, let's put the answer let's go back and check. So we do okay. Let's check our answer. That's for speeding. Can see the answer is correct. Let's close it. 
let's request our mark then the last one is what is the command to quit Ekman Emacs so Emacs is the, the last command is quitting so let's go back to our terminal and uh, we say let me just quickly pull up a bit yes so that is the answer for quitting. Quitting and to enter. Ask the check if you are there. We to continue. Let's go back and check. So as you can see, the answer is correct. So that's that. Thank you very much. Um, I hope I will do more of this video. If you need to have any comment, please drop it in, in the comment section there. I will do more of the video. And I'm going to do C also. When C, when, when C portal is open, I will also answer this question and share with you. Thank you very much.